Hello Taurus, welcome to Femacy Lighthouse and this will be a fairly short reading and straight to the point as I am very busy so I'm doing these readings for my car because there's so much business that I'm taking care of that um, I just did not have time to be at home, okay? <laughs> so um, you have the sun central here, okay? So that's beautiful energy. I just feel that some of you guys could be dealing with a fire sign in Aries, a Leo, or a Sagittarius, primarily a Leo, or you could have Leo in your chart. I just feel that you're rising at this time and you're growing in so many different capacities and areas of your life that anybody that no longer serves you is not a priority, okay? And you're doing such a nice job of detaching yourself and taking your energy away from people who don't deserve you, okay? And I feel that you are finally coming to the realization that you were wasting your time on someone who didn't appreciate you, okay? And it's not gonna stay like that forever, right? I feel like if they didn't appreciate you right now, they're gonna appreciate you in the future because you're no longer giving this person your energy. And at this point, I feel like they can't even get back into your good graces, all right? <laughs> That's how much in control you are of the situation. And out of sight, out of mind, all right? That's exactly how you need to view this situation. You have the victory card here, okay? I see you moving on. There's celebration, the Six of Swords. You are leaving something toxic behind. And there's so much popularity that you are going to be gaining. You are going to be very successful in career. So it's definitely beneficial for you to drop someone who has been weighing you down. Someone who has put you as number two. Someone who has never viewed you as their main topic, their um, main priority, right? Because even if you were the main one, they always made you feel like you're number two, number three, and number four. You don't have time for that anymore. And Taurus doesn't even care. You don't care and you shouldn't care. They don't deserve your energy. If you continue to talk about this person, speak their name, if you continue to bring them up, all you are doing is glorifying them and they feel that energy. Don't speak their name. Don't bring them up. Stop talking about them. They need to know what it's like to lose your energy, whether they like it or not. The fact that you aren't paying them any mind anymore is going to be a deficit for their energy. It doesn't matter what they think, okay? And I just feel like you're moving on, but gracefully and peacefully and you know, you're not being combative about it and you aren't challenging this person. You just don't care. You don't give a shit anymore. I am proud of you. I'm absolutely proud of you because the only way and the best way for revenge is to do better for yourself, right? Leave karma to God. But at the end of the day, I just feel like you're doing so good anyway that the better that you do, the more it shows you who does not belong in your life. And a lot of you are starting to meet new people. And I'm so glad that you're meeting new people because it's the perfect time to do so. Enjoy this new energy around you or this new energy that's about to be around you. Okay? And continue to push forward. Remember, hear no evil, speak no evil. Speak no evil, hear no evil, see no evil. You feel me? So don't give this person attention. Don't speak their name. Don't talk like they do. Don't watch what they do. Don't eat what they do completely drop this person's energy from your existence you're already doing a fabulous job thank you so much for all of your support to book your private reading with me all of that info is below i love you and take care